Alicia Ridley from Try Training Harder, who was the 10K winner here today at the triathlon show. It looked uh, pretty tough out there, Alicia. Just uh, talk us through that 10K. Yeah, it was a tough 10K actually. It was a very multi terrain, windy, lots of hills, and lots of tight bends. So, really tough this morning, and also it was pretty cold. Um, so, times were very quick. It wasn't a PB course, but um, good training run, always good to battle against the elements. So, I'm quite pleased that I came home first. Yeah. So, uh, you're obviously here with, with Try Training Harder, as we can see. So, firstly, it's good to see a triathlete win the, win the 10K. Um, so, um, just tell us a little bit about, about your background and how long you've been. In, uh, in triathlon? Yeah, I actually started when I was 19, um, trained with the development squad down in Swansea for a couple of years, um, went to Swansea University, uh, I got injured quite badly so I had a couple of years off. I then went to Sandhurst, um, commissioned and then I've got really back in triathlon in the last couple of years. The Army Triathlon Association has been really fantastic in supporting me and uh, try training harder a coach me this season. I'm really fortunate to be based out in Portugal with the team. Um, and just everything out there is fantastic. The location, the training facilities are awesome, and I couldn't be more fortunate in being out there for four months on full time training. So, yeah, fantastic. So, uh, in terms of racing, just tell us a little bit about um, the, the distances and some of the events that you're, you're planning to focus on uh, for 2014. Yeah, so last year I had a really good season in the military series, um, won the inter services and the army championships. I did a couple of um, age group races, I did the Worlds in London. This year I've stepped up the training massively and I'm hoping to break into the elite field for the British um, Super Series, I'm hoping to do well in that and hoping to make a few of the ETU races as well. Yeah. Um, so the, the, tell us about how you got involved with Try Training Harder and, and that connection because obviously they've now got quite a, a nice little um, elite sort of well, elite and elite age group team uh, representing them in there as you can see the red and white colours. Yeah. Try Training Harder were at the World Champs last year. I did reasonably well. I find, found out about their race team and applied um, like everybody else did through the application process and was fortunate enough to be one of the lucky athletes that got chosen um, and, th and since then they've just been massively supportive of, of my training and, and coached me and um, just the whole package that goes with it really. Yeah. So what's your sort of background in terms of uh, the, the three sports or have you just developed as a triathlete? Have you got a particular background that you came into the sport I've from? I've always been a runner from a very young age. I started with my first running club at the age of eight. So i um, been to the English schools and competed at the National Office Country Championships throughout my teens really. Um, so background is running uh, but uh, triathlon really manages the, the running side of life. With too much running you just get injured all the time. Which, which I did struggle with injury when I was younger. So the swimming and the biking really supports the running and um, gives you the opportunity to train more if, if, if you want yeah. to train more, but balance it all out at the same time. So, yeah, so you, you mentioned obviously you, you've got the opportunity now to, to spend some time uh, training for triathlon courtesy of uh, the support from the army. So just, just tell us a little bit about um, what you do within the army and, and uh, how you got involved in going to Sandhurst. Yeah. I'm in the Royal Logistic Corps. Um, I've been a troop commander at 29 Regiment, which is based in South Cerny near Simoncester, for two years. I went out to Cyprus, I did a UN tour out there for six months, um, working with the Argentinians and uh, the Slovakians out of patrolling the Green Zone. I came back, um, I then went on a ski season with the biathlon team for three months last winter. This summer I've been back in barracks, um, working with my squadron, um, just normal routine barrack work really and manage, managing my troop. And then this winter I've been fortunate enough to jump on board with the, the Tri Training Harder team and, and train as a full-time athlete, which has always been my dream from a young age. Yeah, well, uh, congratulations on uh, the win today. Nice start to 2014. I'm sure you've got uh, bigger plans to come, but uh, we'll yeah. keep an eye on you and uh, Good luck to you and all the Try Training Harder team. Thank you. Thank you very much. Thank you. Thanks. Cheers.